Here are seven ideas for photo shoots you can do while you're stuck at home. Number one, architecture. Practice your architecture and or real estate photography. Try to think of different ways to shoot certain areas of your house. Maybe focus on one room or area and try to shoot it several unique ways to get cool results. Flip real estate photography on its head. Create a photo series of that particular area. I put out a video a while ago on how to make money with real estate photography. Why not use this time to practice? Number two, creative portraits. If you live with your family, roommate, spouse, partner, whatever, make them model for you. Use different areas in your house to create hundreds of unique portraits with different lighting, scenery, framing, emotions, styles, so on and so forth. If you live alone, do the same, but with self-portraits. It's a little tougher, but I've got a tutorial for that too. Number three, food photography. We've all got food in our house, or at least I hope. If not, maybe that should be a priority over the video. But try out some cool food photography. Make it look as appetizing as possible, or even get crazy with it and be as creative as you can. If you're gonna do food photography, don't be wasteful. Eat the food afterwards, or try using stale food. Number four, pet photos. Got pets? Put them to work. Chase your fur baby around the house and take the most adorable shots you can. Get nice and close, shoot from further back, do something unique that you've never seen before. Everybody loves pet photos anyway. Throw those up on your social media, make your pet a celebrity. Need some tips? I've got a video to help with that one too. Number five, abstract photography. Get wild with it. Take photos of ordinary objects in an abstract way. Turn your salad bowl into something you'd frame and hang on the wall. Try close-ups of everyday objects. Make your viewer guess what it might be. Want to take it to the next level? Try combining shots, double exposures. Just create some art. Number six, phone versus DSLR. Challenge yourself. Try setting up a photo, portrait, product shot, architectural shot, whatever you choose. Take that picture with your camera, then try to replicate it or make it even better using your phone. Seems like the DSLR would win every time, right? Think you can change that? Number seven, fine art photography. Similar to abstract photography, try taking everyday photos and turning it into something you'd see in a gallery. Use shadows or concentrated light sources to create hard lines and points of interest in your photo. Since you're stuck at home anyway, why not put some extra attention into the editing process? We're so focused on getting content out as quickly as possible that we cheat with presets and actions and LUTs. Spend some extra time making sure each photo is perfect. Maybe try editing the same photo a few different ways. Who knows, you might even discover a new style that becomes your own. Hope you guys like those suggestions and it gives you something to do while you're on lockdown, stuck at home, you know. Take full advantage, take as many pictures as you can, edit them properly, take your time, do it well. There are plenty of things you can do, shoot and edit without having to leave that front door. You might as well make use of the time. If you liked the video, thought it was useful, make sure you let me know, leave a comment down below. Make sure you like the video and obviously subscribe if you're not already so I can catch you guys in the next video. Love ya.